What you guys got another video here for you on change one setting to secure Windows 10 and Windows 11. If you want to be much more secure with your operating system, then enabling this feature will reduce the amount of malware infections by 60%. That is a massive figure. So how can we enable this? Let me show you how to do it. First type feature in the search box and go to turn Windows features on or off open this up here and you should see a little box here saying windows features inside here we want to drill down all the way until we see virtual machine platform and windows hypervision platform put a tick in those two boxes and then what we can do here is click ok and this will then go ahead and enable these features for us it does take a bit of time so let it do its thing and once that's done we need to reboot our system so this all takes place so let's go ahead and uh, reboot our system once you've rebooted you should be back at the desktop you can now type core in the search box and you should see uh, core isolation so let's go ahead and type core and you should see core isolation here and i'm going to toggle this on and you can now see we've got memory integrity uh, enabled here once that's done you'll probably be prompted to restart your pc again so let's go ahead and restart the system one more time and I'll go ahead and do that. So I've restarted the system and we're now back at the desktop. I'm going to go back in here again. And I just want to have a look here to show you exactly what we've just enabled here. So for this one, what we're going to do here is go to the uh, privacy and security here. Click on this one on Windows 11 and then up to Windows security. Click on this and inside here, we want to go to device security. Uh, so come all the way down to device security there we go and you should see core isolation uh, and security processor and secure boot and all those have been enabled on here so we've now got a pretty secure system and this is basically a real easy way of making your system more secure and you can see it's fully enabled and it's all ready now a lot of people are going to tell you by enabling this feature you're going to have a massive drop in frames per second this is simply not true and there's a lot of misinformation floating about on the internet saying that by enabling this feature, it really does cripple your PC. And that is not the case. So if you are looking uh, to enable your system to make it more secure, then by all means, go ahead and enable this feature. It's going to reduce the amount of malware by up to 60%, which is a must thing in 2022. It can help against ransomware attacks as well. Now, if you don't believe me, you can enable this feature and play games on it and check your FPS and then turn it off and check your FPS. Also on Microsoft's blog here, you can see VBS and HVCI enable devices to help protect from other infections like malware, ransomware and other things like that. So these advanced attacks will cripple the system. I will leave the links for this information in the video description so you can read this at your own leisure. But basically down here is where the information tells you about it blocking up to 60%, which for me is a no-brainer. Uh, you definitely need this enabled on your PC. Now, you're going to get a lot of misinformation, like I said, on the internet, telling gamers that this really does cripple your PC and stuff. I'll make another separate video about all that information uh, so you can see it for yourself. And I'll maybe do some benchmarks with it on and with it off so you can actually see the results with it on or off you're not going to see much of a difference and certainly not some of the claims that i'm reading online where they're saying it's reducing the performance up to 20 to 30 percent that is not the case anyway but that said my name has been brian from brightechcomputers.co.uk just want to say a quick shout out to my youtube members who have joined my youtube members group i appreciate the support and i shall see you again for another video real soon bye for now